hit TV show, This Is Us, kicks off its sixth and final season tomorrow. And the diverse cast includes New York native John Huertas. The veteran TV actor plays Mia Rivas on the show. So let's take a look at a clip from tomorrow's episode. Every morning since I got here, I Facebook stalked the girl who got away. I told you about her, right? Sally? Sally, yes. Yeah. Yes, you tell us about her every day. Every single day. Well, every single day I lose my nerve, even though she's just a few hours from here. Here I am on a baby train. Oh, Nikki Shush. <laughs> and who doesn't like trains? Oh, I love this. John Huertas joins us live to discuss the show and so much more. Good morning and welcome to the PIX11 Morning News. Good morning. Happy New Year. Thanks for having me. Happy New Year to you, too. Uh, do you have any words right that on. you're happy or banished that you'd, ha you'd like to see go away? We were just discussing words or phrases that we can't stand, like, I'll circle back. Or... Yeah, I definitely don't like to circle back, but one that wasn't on there is uh, sidebar. Can we sidebar this? That wasn't on there. I like that one, too. Well, I'd like to get rid of that one. Fantastic. First mm -hmm. of all, congratulations on everything that you have accomplished. Thank you. Um, oh. so, so we know the show creator Dan Fogelman says a major storyline in the final season will be the relationship between your character, Miguel, and Rebecca, played my man, Bandy Moore, how they came together and how they separated, how they found their way back to each other. What can you tell us about this upcoming season? I promise I won't tell anyone. Just tell me everything. Let me start from the beginning. Um, <laughs> I, I can't, I mean, I, yeah, we're just really not allowed to say anything, but I can, I can say that, you know, the, I think the long-awaited um, kind of story between Miguel and Rebecca is definitely um, something that we're excited to tell. Um, uh, Mandy and I have shot a lot of stuff from that uh, storyline already, which has been um, joyful, sad, uh, amazing. I, you know, the chemistry I have with Mandy is just, just great. So, you know, it's always um, amazing to share the screen and, and to sh share scenes with her. And it's just um, amazing to, to see the whole thing unfold. I'm looking at all these still pictures and to see the breadth of work that you've done over all these seasons. Um, what was it like to be on the other side of the camera as a director? Because I know you had the opportunity to direct some of the episodes. And I always wonder when actors direct their contemporaries, what is that like? Is there ever any friction? Is it collaborative? Uh, for, for this show, for sure, very collaborative. Um, you know, there's a trust built in, I think, between all of us uh, as cast members. So you want that as a director mm -hmm. as well. You want the same trust from the actors. So they trust that you're, they're, you're steering the ship in the right direction. So everybody was very supportive, very um, excited for, for me to direct. And all of us that have been able to direct on the show now that are actors that, that wanted to you know, kind of take that next step in our careers. Everybody's just been uh, supportive, especially the crew, especially Dan and the writers. Like, it's really been, um, you know, great to be embraced in a, in a, with another hat on your head. Right. I, I, I can tell you, when we, when word got out that you were joining us this morning, everyone on the floor was like, oh, my gosh, I love that show. Oh, my gosh, that show brought me to tears. What do you think has made this show resonate with people? Because for me, I feel like you really saw real-life people. Um, you know, I think a lot of us, especially after the couple of years we've had, we turn to television and movies because we want to see a different version of us reflected. Um, but, but why do you think the show ha has resonated with so many folks? I mean, I think the show has resonated with people because each one of the characters on our show, I think that people can find either um, a piece of themselves in that character, uh, a story that's either happened to them or someone they know in their lives that they see kind of unfold every week on our show or, or a piece of it every week on our show, they're able to take that and, um, and, feel, and it feels familiar to them. And I think we as a family, as, as a family show, feel familiar enough to the audience to where they think they connect uh, to at least one character in right. some way, whether it is in their past or whether it is you know, in their present day. And I think that that's nostalgic for people and, and they really love to, um, to tell, help us tell the story. Right. You continue to help tell stories uh, as a director because you also directed a short film that premiered at the Tribeca Film Festival. Tell us about it and do you see yourself directing bigger parts in your career going forward? Yeah, I mean, I, I feel like there's a responsibility for me to direct. You know, I've been working in the business for um, 26 years and for me personally in television uh, specifically, I've only been directed by one guy that looks like me. Hmm. So I feel like I need to be, uh, you know, for the next crop of, of young Latinx 
actors and performers coming up. I want them to be able to look on the other side of the camera and see me and, and believe that I understand what kind of choices they're making because I might have similar life experiences. Um, so I'm definitely going to be directing a lot more and, um, and developing content as well. We have a production company called West Side Stories, mm -hmm. and, and we've got tons of projects that we are really excited about. So. Um, yeah, that, that's, there is a new career path, um, but you know, if if something really, you know, feels right for me to, to be in front of the camera, I'd like to continue that uh, work as well. Well, we hope you continue doing the work in front of the camera and behind the camera. Para la cultura, thank you so much, John. With us, continued success. Congratulations! I can't believe the show is coming to an end, and you can watch yeah. the final episode of This Is Us uh, starting tomorrow night on NBC. Mwah. Felicidades! Thank that's you so right. much for spending Thank the morning you. with us. All right, see you guys. Thank you.